This is 9524 Plain Circle in Frisco, Texas. It's located in the trails, 2724 square feet with three bedrooms, two and a half baths. This is the exterior shot. This is the street and it's on neighbors. It's in a little cul-de-sac. Rear entry. Nice, quiet neighborhood. The Trails is a very popular neighborhood in Frisco. It's much sought after. House has nice curb appeal. Those dark, those dark windows that you see are actually screens that are solar screens because when the, this house is west facing, so when the sun sets in the evening, uh, this keeps the bright light out and reduces your energy bills. This is a, a nice little patio here in the front with brick. You can actually sit out here, maybe have coffee in the morning. And we go in. Tile floor. Most of the house is tile floor. There's laminate here in the dining room. So the dining room is off to the right. Staircase off to the left. High ceilings. Spacious entrance. Very nicely designed. And we'll go into the kitchen. Kitchen is off to the right. It's electric although they do have gas service into the house, so this could be converted. Microwave over the stove, refrigerator. Breakfast nook. And we go into living area. Nice living area with, a, with an electric fireplace. Sorry, gas fireplace, gas log fireplace. They've got a little television here. You could put a larger television in there, or you could mount one above the above the fireplace. But they have a room upstairs that they use to watch TV. There's an office area here with French doors. Carpeted. Crown moldings. And powder room. So there is no tub on the first level. There's a, under the staircase, there's a big storage area, which is nice to have. Laundry. to a, a two-car garage. And you've got two water heaters that are relatively new, which is nice. You can tell by the, by the new uh, brass fittings. Stairs. I'll go up the staircase. Carpeted. Carpet is original equipment, so this has not been replaced in a while. And this is this is very wide open. And this is an attractive way to do this. A lot of times in houses like this, they leave this wide open. Whereas here, you've got these little nooks, which add a nice decorative feature. Like I said, this would make a great uh, television room. Not media room, because you can't really close it off, but you could, um, you know, put speakers and a television up here. Nice and bright. Now, when you come up the stairs, the master is off to the right to this arch ceiling. 
good size room. Freshly painted. And you get to see me in the picture there. Walk-in closet. I'm going to go back out into the bathroom. Show you the tub and the shower. Dual sinks. And toilet areas behind that door. this room. We'll leave the master, go to the opposite end of the hall. And you have full bath, dual sinks, tub area and toilet. And this is bedroom two. These are nice size rooms with a walk-in closet. It's bedroom three with a walk-in closet. Let me go back out. Stairs to go into the attic. And we'll go down and up out the back. Again, this is nice. This is nice. This is a nice and open feel. Even though it's only 2,700 square feet, it makes the house appear like it's much larger. And in the dining room, this is laminate floor, which is very nice from a wear resistance standpoint. It's very close to the, the appearance of wood. Because this is really on a corner, the backyard is a little on the small side. But with the Texas heat, they've done a very nice job in the overhang here. And this is a nice area to sit outside, have dinner, sit down and relax, have a couple of cocktails. Again, it's a relatively small backyard because it's on a corner and it has a rear entry. So I'll go back down and we're back here. And give you an idea. Perfect for a small dog. And children, although there's not really room to throw baseballs and and what have you, but there's plenty of parks and trails, public swimming pool, or not a public swimming pool, but a membership swimming pool in the trails. And I will actually go out the front door and go around the side of the house so you can see how it's positioned. you're located. I don't know if you have alleys but in this part of the country. Alleys are somewhat common. Look over here. Give you another perspective of the house. Heating and air conditioning in this dual zone. New fence. Nice. These fences are expensive. This person next door 
has created a gate, an electric gate, so that actually opens when their car comes in. We could do that here and reclaim this part of the yard. This is the alley behind the house. And the reason I'm showing you this is that with a with younger kids, teen, teens, and they could actually come out here and play and throw balls because this is relatively safe. There's no traffic back here. It's a brick wall that separates the teal. And so this is the this is the rear entry into the house. And get the air conditioning. There's a gas meter, so there's gas into the house. Okay, so. so you could actually extend this fence and put a gate very similar to what the guy has there. So, that's it. 9524 Plain Circle. Thanks.